All right, doing a little update today. Get the uh, got the engine out of here. Everything looks pretty good inside here. Uh, this is the clutch area. The the clutch um, the clutch itself. The uh, clutch is. The, all the mechanicals are fine. I had one bolt I had to cut off, so I'm gonna have to locate another bolt. But um, but the discs and the springs are way out of spec. I mean, it was like I went by the uh, by the calipers, and I can't. I don't know exactly what the uh, caliper <coughs> said, but I went by what the books. The, this book here picked up this book online. The climber manuals. It was like thirty bucks for that book, but <coughs> but. I got the front wheel off. There's the new tire I'm gonna put on here. And I was going through my brake cables and I I ended up ended up at ordering from eBay some new uh, levers here, some setups here. This is from the that's from the blast or some odd parts that I picked up. But these this one was broke. This one is fine, but this one is was broke. It's funny how you uh, when you start tearing tearing shit apart that you find all these parts that are broken. <laughs> but the cables are in good shape. Um, when I took took the motor off, I mean, I, I took the motor off. Handlebars were bent, uh, so right now, right now I'm in the process of uh, tearing this thing apart. It looks like I may have to buy some uh, bushings. For this down here, these linkages, it's, it's well, it's not it's not hanging there. But when you lift up on the when this thing's hanging, you lift up on the shock, and it's like it's like it's there's a lot of free play in there. So I'm gonna have to uh, tear apart the uh, swing arm part. <laughs> Don't know if I'm going to be able to get the the shock apart. I'm not really sure how that goes apart, but uh, but this is what I I take the rear tire off. That's the new tire in there, and it looks pretty good with the uh, paint job. But still, oh man, it's like. Questionable, but I'm gonna get this uh, get this swing arm off and uh, clean it up really good. I'm gonna I probably repaint it. I may just I may just well paint take everything off and repaint everything. So, I don't know. So, but it, I had to bend the uh, the handlebars. They were quite out of out of whack. I hope I didn't bend them too straight. It's a little bit of a but anyways. 
so I got I, I got still a lot of work to do. Now this is the part right here. This Kickstarter, you see, right here. Um, how it fits right in there. Now it's now it is supposed to sit kind of like like this, more. 90 degree ish. So if it sits 90 degrees like this, there's a little bit of gap here. So it looks like it's a little wore out right there. So I'm going to put a little well bead in there, keep it from going all the way and some of the parts this is the uh, skid plate and the skid plate and all the bolts for the engine mount and everything I got the new uh, exhaust uh, o-ring so clutch cable I had to take uh, PB blaster our blaster out and sprayed down the line and now it, now both all the uh, <clears throat> all these things are lo loose now and I'm ordering a new uh, cable for for the throttle Oop. ordering a new throttle cable so Gotta get used to this camera. I'm not used to this camera. Excuse my mess. So and I got this I got the front tire off today. I'm gonna clean up the rim. It's got a little bit of rusty rust on it. But the bearings seem to be in good shape. So I'm gonna try to as minimal as possible put this bike back together and sell it you know because I don't want to just dump uh, you know five hundred six hundred dollars and only get eight hundred dollars out of it so we'll see but I just thought I'd do an update on this um, didn't be a lengthy video and uh, we shall see on that case there I'm gonna I've got the sandblaster out there I bought a uh, sandblasting kit and I'm gonna be uh, taking the stuff out of there and cleaning the case up and then the other side of that uh, of the uh, where the stator is I'll probably be uh, where the charger is or whatever um, the stator or the flywheel on that I'm probably going to take that off and sandblast it you know get it cleaned up and maybe do the engine you know it's it's hard to say um, but whoever went in there and painted everything gray or something some shit like that and black so that's where I'm at like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know.